Am I recording? Yes, I am. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday she wolf, happy birthday to you. Bye-bye. <laughs> No, you know um, Brothers Water Pub down here. If you pull into Brothers Water Pub, there's a walkway down there. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful view, isn't it, Kirkston Pass? Beautiful road. <laughs> I wonder what the Knights of the Wolven Realm are going to think to this road. I wonder if the joiners on here sometime. How's that one, Wolfie? Do you, do you fancy uh, having a, a little ride around on these roads? Yep. That pop, pop, pop from exhaust is nice. It's amazing we aren't any cars up here behind us and as soon as we get over the top of the hill we've got two more. He's gone for a walk. No idea, unless he's broken down. Yeah. If this bike, uh, this car don't get off my arse. I'm going to cry. <laughs> mm. So today guys we're out with She Wolf and uh, yeah celebrating a birthday. Um, we're going for a a barbecue. Yeah, I've got the barbecue in the bag. I'm going down a place called Ullswater. So, yeah, I might take some pictures. I might just get absolutely naked and jump in a lake. What do you think, she will? <laughs> yeah. The shrinkage will be amazing, I'm telling you. <laughs> yeah. 
So yeah guys, this is Kirkston Pass, then we've got to go through a place called Glen Ridden. Um, one of my favourite little places just to eat out, a place called Farlight Cafe. Um, yeah, owned by two Vietnamese people now for the past 25, 30 years. The food's quite reasonable prices, but excellent flavour. Yeah, five poor rating, she will says. And then you've got um, Hullswater. So I think Ian Hughes likes parking up on Hullswater, don't you, Ian? Yeah, of course, I think so. He normally pusses out and goes in the van. But yeah, motorbikes, the only way to travel. It's my only form of transport now, so I've never been a fan of cars. I do like the uh, Porsche 944 938. Um, I like the styling of it, but would I have one? No. <laughs> but I do like the styling of the Porsche. And my favourite looking car is the Dodge Viper or the Chrysler RT10, I believe. I like the look of them cars, but I'd rather have a sports bike. Um, a Ducati would be nice. I just can't justify spending Ducati money. Sorry Ducati NYC, but the beautiful bikes, they sound nice, especially the monsters. They've got a decent fur to the engine. Um, it's just that I like Yamaha. I like the styling, I like I like the sound, I like the um, I like everything about them really. The reliability is a plus. And for a 26 year old bike, I'm still having fun on her, so why should I get rid of this and get another bike? I don't really like the bikes with the new up-to-date um, Rider 8s, if you want to call it that, like uh, braking assist, anti... Uh, and I can't even remember what the name is. ABS, uh, you know. Yeah, anti-raking system. I had an R1, which I'm not going to talk much about because, um, yeah, it failed on me. The ABS failed on me and I hit a stone wall. Luckily, I had full gear, Risha gloves, um, tech speed jacket, tech speed trousers, RST boots. Um, but I still received a broken shoulder and a um, cracked hip cracked hip bone luckily I was doing about 45 50 mile an hour and I was on a place called Cold Coniston these are all new stories for she wolf as well and she's listening on the radio so yeah um, bikes are my only form of transport for the last 45 46 years I've been riding since I was 14 um, I come from a biker background, uh, my dad and my uncle uh, used to have a motorcycle club called Dern Valley Jokers, I believe, way way back in the 60s, and uh, I grew up around them listening to ACDC, Motorhead, um, Sabbath, yay, Sabbath, rock and roll, the idea is right now my favourite airborne airborne band from Australia I do like listening to them I never listen to music out on the road I'm just getting used to uh, talking on the microphone to be honest and uh, yeah just a quick update now I am used to talking on the bike uh, I've got a Shelby helmet a, G a GT Air Mark II uh, Deviation TC9 if you want to look up the colour code for it um, I've got, like I said, um, full tech speed leathers, pretty cheap but full five point armour, knees, shoulders, back and elbows. Um, as my mate Wolfie said from the Wolven Realm, um, these tech speed gloves are the ones with the knuckle on the back, plenty of uh, palm protection. Um, yeah, She Wolf bought them for me for my birthday last year. So, yeah, I'm quite well protected, but dressed for the slide and not the ride, so they say. 
I mean, today's 25 degrees, guys, uh, and I'm out in full leathers. Um, yeah, she will too. She's the she's the show off. She's got a Shoebuth helmet. I don't know the actual model number of it. 28 28 mile an hour through that then. S2 Sport Wave. Yeah, Schuber S2 Sport Wave. Um, if I'm repeating myself, it's, I don't know, it's unscripted, I'm not a Harold Balder. <laughs> Sorry, Harold. Um, yeah, I don't believe in scripts. I think it's, you live for the moment, you live for the day. I think if you're wasting time doing your scripts, personally, if I'm wasting time doing scripts, I'm not going out on the bike and enjoying myself. And with the bike being my only form of, you know, travel, I need my bike. So, yeah. Nice little story about She-Wolf. I think if you want to join She-Wolf's channel, uh, She-Wolf Adventures, uh, she'll tell you about um, how she became to be riding. But until a year ago, she'd never even sat on a bike, let alone ridden a bike. So literally a year, year to gay, we've been together. And um, we got married last November, November the 7th, which is a special day for me personally. So anyway, there's, there's a little bit of Ullswater Lake for you. I can't really look right for a long time. But lakeside boat hire. You can legally start a barbecue around here. Um, it's a nice place. Enjoy the ride. Yeah, Jix, a one, two, five there. Yeah. Don't Andy rides have a Jix125? Yeah. Well, you'd upgrade little Mr. Jixer. Yeah, nice. What a choice. Um, she Wolf's next bike. Um, a, GX, a GSXR125 or a Yamaha YZFR125. Which, which do you guys think? People are going to be telling me to shut up on YouTube soon. <laughs> now I've got me, uh, I've found my tongue. Look at that. Amazing view, that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm looking forward to a quiet evening sit by the lake and chew some meat just like a wolf should <laughs> a wild she-wolf yeah this bike's far too noisy for around here it feels like I'm waking the lakes Right guys, we're near near the parking space. We're just hoping there's nobody in there. Just around this corner, basically. Yay! I'm gonna turn around. There you go, guys. Get off the bike and like have a little look around.
Yeah, the highlands dry and it's got um, somebody's left some firewood down there. It is very good. It's beautiful, isn't it, guys? So this is all was all's water, and I'll catch you guys in a little while. Enjoy the view. recording yeah ready well I don't know what happening with them police cars that went by yeah 15 cop cars yeah Two ambulances, two riot vans, and rest were cars. Strange, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep a speed of forty mile an hour. Is that okay? There's cops down here. Lots of... Well, where's these cop cars coming to and coming... Uh, cars coming from? Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, could do. But we've seen cars coming by. Hmm. Yeah. I didn't see this many cars parked here when we came by, did you? Mm, yeah. I don't know what's happening. You don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. No? Okay. Lad there says turn around, no chance. Mm, not to my knowing yet. because I saw two pass, a red one and a black one. Yeah. Oh, no. Cheers, mate. Sad news. Yeah, thank you. Did you see what happened? Female rider as well. Did 
Did she get off the bike? Yeah. Thank you. Cheers, mate. So guys, we found out that it's another bike. Female. Female rider. She's alright, because she jumped off the mountain time, but she went down the mountain too quick, because she's... Well, she's not going to be moving, she's just going to be moving off the mountain. Do you want to go park back at the farmyard? Do you want to park back at that farmyard? Okay. Yeah. I really don't know. I'm going to check Google Maps in a minute. I don't know if there's any way over Kirkston. Let's go and park up Farmyard, yeah? Very, very sad. Do you want to park here for a bit? Yeah. yeah? Be careful how you park in here. Off camber and all that. I'm going to move right down to end. Yeah. So guys, looks like we're in for about a <laughs> couple of hours wait, so, Brow of the Silly said, that one, nice enough, mm. yeah, right then guys, I'm going to cut it off for now, and uh, hopefully catch her on my own. Peace and ciao for now. Well, we waited there for about a couple of hours, dudes, but the cop said it could be a couple of hours more until they clear the road. We were waiting there for about an hour. Uh, we saw an ambulance driver and he said it could be hours still. So I'm going to keep the camera rolling on the way um, home. I'm not going to talk much because quite a sad situation, don't know what to say right now. We've had a good barbecue and it's been a weird ending to She Wolf's birthday ride but we're both in good spirits, we're both on the bikes, we're both enjoying the ride still. So yeah guys, we'll catch you on the next one. Enjoy the views. Yeah, it's nice there. <laughs> Put your visor down. <coughs> yeah.
close your visor. Yeah, put your visor down. That's how I lost my left eye. Oh, it'll stay dry. This corner's a bit of a t Yeah. It's a long drawn out corner. Water milk. Oh. Yeah, it's beautiful. I like this area. Yeah. Miles, absolutely miles away from an Asda's. <laughs> what? A yeah. Well, I heard it coming for miles, like you did. Yeah, because if they're coming from this way, look at roads, I mean they're good enough for 80, but when you get round them bends there, <coughs> 80 is too quick. Yeah, straight on. Just carry on. Yeah, this is Pooley Bridge. Yeah. Sun in, yeah. Cheers. No. It won't. Oh, it will. Go on. Well done. I could do a cup of coffee right now. Yes, 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 Kendall, straight on. Well, I don't know what kind of uh, image they're going to see on footage, but I don't know if the cameras are any good at night time. Yeah. It's not what we had planned though, is it? Yeah. Bit of dual carriage ray, nice.
I can't see anything through visor, I've got a carpet. I'm just letting Christine take me home. Oh, she knows this road. Well, Pete, the previous owner of this bike, used to go to work on this bike. Up sharp, so... Yeah. And at higher speed than we're doing it. And at much higher speed than we're doing it. Yeah. Well, yeah. I love you. Say again. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's a nice enough run anyway, that. We must be high up now. My ears have just popped. Yeah, it's beautiful during the day, as you can see. Yeah, I would. Yeah. Sixty mile an hour. Do you want me to overtake? Beautiful place, this, isn't it? Yeah. I've got my cruise control on. <laughs> <laughs> this is the top of shop here. Cool. It's a good straight road. Civilization. K 
candle. Yay! Jaguar. Yay! It's a little bit of fresh air. Nice. Cool. Cool. I don't even get to play on the dual carriageway. Nah. Nah, we're already in Kendall now. I like how he dipped his lights for us. Mm. Nice. Done 83 mile today. Back into the darkness. For the last seven miles. I will do when I get to the bridge. I love you. Yeah. Right, I'll see you at home. I love you. See you in a bit. So guys, that was Allswater A66 and A6 back home. Hope you enjoyed the ride. And I hope them guys on the bikes are okay. Doesn't sound good though. Until the next one. Peace.